We are here in Mauritius, I can't quite believe it. And we just literally dropped our bags. So we're gonna freshen up and go and grab some food. Bathroom. Bedroom. It's all eco-friendly, so no plastics. And we've got balcony. Balmar Beach, just across from us. Hey, look. Hey, so it is, we've basically just finished our first full day in Mauritius. It was a very slow start because of how late we woke up, but we had a really chill day by the pool and now we're off to dinner. So I've just done my makeup and I'm gonna let my hair dry naturally because I can't really be bothered to be honest. <laughs> so yeah, we'll let you know how we get on. for our workouts. Very sweaty, cardio is done, and now we are on to weights. Go on, lad. Hopefully today we will be going to the beach. It looks absolutely beautiful, so we will bring you along for sure. Good morning. So we just got back from breakfast and today we are going to the gym and then we are going to go for a really long walk along the beach. So we will take you along so that you can see how beautiful this place really is. Today we are going to do a south tour of the island. So we're going to see a waterfall, a temple, we're going to do some shopping and see some really nice views. So I'm going to take you along with me and I'm really excited to see what we get up to today.
amazing day. We did our tour of the whole of the south of the island. We saw, what did we see? Waterfalls, we saw monkeys, we saw tortoises. National parks. We saw national parks with awesome coloured sands. And we saw a Hindu temple and we got blessed by a Hindu priest. Yeah. And we got back and we were really tired and we just went for some drinks. And today we have a massage booked at 11, so in one hour's time. But this morning we woke up at 5.50, no, 5.30 a.m to go and do a secret sunrise trip with the hotel and it was meditation and yoga on the beach with the sunrise. It was really, really cool. Speak to you soon. From the market and we made some cool purchases especially Dan he got like a t-shirt and a shirt and now we are going to spend the rest of the day on the beach relaxing good morning it is the last day of my 20s and we are going on a catamaran for lunch so this is my cute little outfit is it on? Is it on? Also, we've officially been here for one week. It's Thursday morning and we got here Thursday morning, I think. Yeah, we got here Thursday morning. So we've been here a week. I can't believe it. I'm so glad we booked two weeks because it just means we can do so much and we really need get to experience the whole island and not feel rushed and not feel like we don't get a chance to relax as well. So I'm so, so happy we did two weeks. So if you ever go to Mauritius, definitely try and do two weeks, at least 10 days. Um, yeah, because there's a lot to explore, but also you kind of want those days in between to just relax and be here and enjoy the moment. So yeah, I'm so happy that we've been here a week and we have a whole other week before we go home. And yeah, it's exciting. way to end a decade of my life I don't know why I'm weirdly emotional about that but um, I think I, today I felt super super grateful about um, how I decided to change my life in my 20s and do things like jump in to a to the sea from a boat or snorkel or feel confident and comfortable in myself 
and just feel strong and powerful and like be able to like pull myself up onto the boat again you know things like that I just feel very very grateful for today craziest couple of days I haven't actually told you what I've been doing so the day before yesterday we did our catamaran which was an incredible four and a half hour lunchtime catamaran boat tour and we had lunch and the guys on the boat were amazing they just like I basically was drinking water and then eventually I was like okay I'll have a wine and then as soon as I had that wine glass they were literally there topping it up, topping it up, topping it up. As soon as like, it was like the slightest bit empty, they were just topping it up. And then they cooked us the most incredible lunch. We went snorkeling, we went swimming in this like beautiful green, like jade green waters. It was literally the best day, one of the best days of my life. And I was literally like, wow, my birthday is tomorrow and I literally can't get better than this. But then we, <laughs> we had our, um, we had our private, so basically we booked for my birthday, we decided to go all out and we booked a private speedboat to help take us to swim with the dolphins, see the whales, if there were any, and then take us to a private island, an uninhabited island, sorry, to, yeah, have a look at that and have lunch. So basically, I didn't think it could get better than the catamaran, but 
that day my birthday was probably even better like at least as good as and basically I swam with dolphins I saw massive massive dolphins right next to me I could literally touch them I didn't touch them though because I didn't want them to get angry <laughs> not that they would but you never know um so yeah so swam with the dolphins saw whales from the boats saw crystal rock and then traveled to the island which had like it's an uninhab uninhabited island we had a barbecue lunch and they surprised me with birthday cake which was absolutely amazing and then we came back to the hotel and had dinner and i was surprised with another cake and i literally had the best day ever someone's at the door Are you okay? Yeah, yeah. Did you save the bug? Yeah. The bug's dead. Huh? The bug's dead. Yo, yo, yo. So my boyfriend came in the room last night and then I completely just forgot to record the rest of my vlog. So we came back here and we had dinner and then we had some drinks with our friends that we've met and some shisha. So it was literally just the best day. So yeah, that was my birthday. And then the day after that, we were literally knackers as yesterday. We were just so tired. We just basically had a chill day around the pool. Dan played some games, um, watched some football. I just like chilled, read a book, listened to a podcast. Um, and yeah, literally just, just had a very chill day yesterday. So that was, that was good. And I think today we're gonna do the same, to be honest. We're just gonna have another sort of chill day, try and do some reading, really relax going to walk to Balmar, maybe grab, um, basically just do another walk along the beach. So it'll be quite a chill day today, which would be nice. Um, but yeah, I'm really excited. Um, also, oh my gosh, also in other news, because it was my birthday, they offered us an upgrade. So they offered us um, a swim up room. So basically we are on the nice, nice block with the swim up rooms, but the swim up rooms are just below us. So anyway, they offered us um, a swim up room and we were like, yes. raining I'll show you room upgrade very very happy so we are just sorting ourselves out aren't we Daniel yeah we are Nikki and uh, let's show you the room so big four post to bed this time bed looks similar like in size basically massive <laughs> And then this is our cute little balcony thing with like the swim up room and the two sun beds. wanted to do a quick Nikki vlog update. Now since my birthday we've been on a bit of a come down to be honest and just chilling enjoying the hotel, being by the pool, going to the local beach and just really trying to relax and to be fair we've had a really great time so I haven't been filming as much because there's not really much to tell you other than we've been doing lots of chilling, lots of eating, lots of drinking and just really enjoying our time here. So obviously I'll show you some pictures of the hotel and the pool and the beach. And today we're gonna to do the same because it's our last full day. And we fly home tomorrow evening. So I've just had the most amazing time and we're just kind of on the, on the come down now, I guess, towards flying home. So we're just gonna try and make the most of it while we're here. I'll speak to you soon. <laughs> do a little mirror shot and 
talk about today. So today was our last full day in Mauritius. Tomorrow we fly home, tomorrow evening. My hair's wet because I've just showered and styled it. So sorry about that. But I've got my cute little outfit on. I'm not sure yet if the skirt goes with the top. I'm gonna ask Dan when he comes back from the bar. <laughs> and if it doesn't go, then I'll change into like a white, white shorts or something. Oh, I've got my black trousers, but they're for the airport. So I kind of don't want to wear them tonight. But yeah, this is what we're going for. Like summery, you know, mismatch of colors. I don't know. What goes with a rainbow top? That is the question. So I'm going to do some packing now. Maybe get a latte so I get a bit of a second wave of energy for our last evening. We're going to meet our friends for some drinks. Our friends that we met out here, which is really cool. And yeah, I'm pretty chuffed. We also managed to go to the gym three times, which I'm quite like glad about. To be honest, I didn't even have much energy when I was there, but I'm just glad I got a bit of a pump on and got some endorphins in me, um, as if I didn't need any more being here. But yeah, thanks for following along on my blog and I will show you our last evening, our last day tomorrow and our flight home back to the UK. <laughs> lovelies we had a good time in Mauritius just waiting for the flight to, to load and then we do it in um, well order indeed flight home now sad are you sad so sad I'm actually so sad had the best two weeks ever best two weeks ever it's been so good it's been good see you on the other side <laughs> 